In and out. He, he, he does. Um, What's well, so in and out? Is that like condom company? No, it's like condom uh, brand. It's like fast food, burgers and chips. What in and out? It's the company that hot delivered hot the kids hot. to the island. Perverts. <laughs> no, it's just like a, Wait, uh, it's it? like a Five Guys or a McDonald's. I wouldn't call in it in and out. Do you know what I mean? I'm not that I'm homophobic, but do you know what I mean? Well, that sounds bad even for food. It sounds like yeah, you straight, straight couples like. would come to your restaurant, <laughs> would they? It's <laughs> like you eat and you get diarrhoea or something. Yeah. Sounds like what actually, yeah, it's pretty homophobic. All you're talking about, but cut most of this. Look. Yeah, you fucking you're sick, aren't you? It's not my fault. I was born in the uh, you know a while back. back. Yeah, or something is to the late Victorian. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, every a, every like clip he does, he does a little clip for him on Instagram. Yeah, and he's like, "Have you got clip for us?" I clip for us. Oh, oh clip for us? No, I haven't got a clip. But clip for, um, clip for us. He he says, clip "Oh, look, it's my first time having In and Out, and uh, I've got uh, my the double burger, like double fries, double or whatever." Yeah, like Who two said lots this? Of big burgers. The Rock. Is that how he talks now? I'm hungry. But it's, it's been like a, a reoccurring <laughs> thing for like quite a few years. No like he does, it's like every few years he does it, and so he keeps on saying it's the first time so I've had in and out. So every year he has in and out for the first time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's great. That must be so exciting. But the thing is, he doesn't, he doesn't, show, he doesn't eat it on the clip. He just shows that he's bought it. So it technically is the first time because <laughs> he, he never gets around to eating it. Yeah, he probably launched it at the wall. Like, I'm not eating that shit. <laughs> You've seen the shape of it. And yeah, then again, he could you. probably eat that. And I've not seen the shape of it. What the shape of you? Oh, isn't that? Oh no, I was thinking of Shape of Water. Have you seen that film? She fucks a fucking fish. Anyway, really? <laughs> well, a while of a time. It's a humanoid fish. <laughs> what really? do you smell worse, her or the fucking fish? A humanoid oh. fish. Yeah, that's what this, she falls in love with. This, like humanoid fish, and then she starts like, abusing. End up battered. Is that not what we are? <laughs> <laughs> then she sent to school. Nice. Then he lost. He was in too deep. <laughs> And then you know, and then he got weed. Oh, I was gonna say, I was gonna say he got kicked out of school because he was smoking seaweed. No, go on, say it. He got kicked out of school because he was smoking seaweed. <laughs> <laughs> and as he left the school, all his friends waved. Ah, uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> he got kicked out of school. Ah, <laughs> he got kicked out of school. <laughs> <laughs> and then he had to smoke. <laughs> And he smoked a reefer. I know no, 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 that he doesn't understand what you said, or he's just carrying on a joke about letting you. I can't tell. He sucked on his cockle. Oh, fuck. I'm sure. Manatee. He paid her octopusy. Sucked on the manatees. Oh, manatees! Uh, <laughs> I don't know what the fuck we're doing all the time. Uh, but her toy was very sick. In fact, her doll's thin. Oh, oh no. Dolphins rape. Right. I went to the aquarium. Yeah? What happened? It was huge, the largest in the UK. Really? It's amazing. Wow. You meet all sorts of people there. But not animals. <laughs> not animals. Well, you meet humans people. and you see the, you know, the aquarium animals. Human what animals did you see? Shark. Turtle. <laughs> <laughs> what animals did you see? Shark. Turtle. <laughs> <laughs> Ray. I went, all right, Ray, how you doing? Down in the um, Yeah, all sorts. Starfish. Lobsters. Shrimp, turtle, <laughs> turtle. <laughs> oh, I could you do it some shrimp. Saw Leonardo, did you? DiCaprio, Ralph. Nah, Ralph. This was the Quarry in Plymouth. All right. Oh, oh maybe that was the Leonardo that was in the island. What the turtle? Not DiCaprio, surely not. Splinter. Oh. Well, we've done half an hour, so we can wrap up if you want. You can wrap up if you want, or yeah, you can keep talking shit, see how much you've done half of this episode. Yeah, remember what was coming on, already. coming in? Huh? There was a boy yeah. that uh, beat Tetris. Oh, I was meant to look that up. What, no one's ever beat it before then? No, no. first time ever. Well, it, in the world? was like 13, yeah, never. You technically can't beat it, so he beat it because he kept going up and up, each, in, in, each level further and further. He wasn't losing, he just kept advancing. It couldn't collect any more scores, so everything was on 9. So what is so it? So it just Grand. stopped. Tetris. Tetris. Yeah, what is it? You don't know Tetris? Is it where you put the wooden blocks on top of yeah, each other? Yeah, yeah. yeah, but they fall down. Yeah. Like one of the oldest games ever. Yeah. It's never been beaten. It's like. never been beaten? No. What, is that, how old is it? About 2,000 years? 3,004? <laughs> Jesus one playing Tetris. Well, you know, they had games in them days, so I just wonder, you know, they built the pyramids, didn't they? That must be not for me. <laughs> well, crazy how old is Tetris? I Google it. Yeah. It's probably like 
What are you saying? A hundred. Two thousand. A thousand. A couple hundred. A thousand. Maybe a thousand, fifteen hundred? I'll say. Bits from China or something. Two thousand. Go two thousand years. Tetris. Really? Oh, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. no, I'm no, I'm hundred. I'm sick of it. A hundred? Really? Now, nah. probably coming out of China, two thousand BC or something. One point BC. <laughs> yeah, before Christ. God made His amendment, like the first amendment. <laughs> is it amendment? Is it? Right, that's just like Rich God, that is that three thousand of them, and He also made Tetris at the same time. <laughs> like God said, let there be light, and let there be Tetris. <laughs> switched on the light, and there was some sticks, and, and it's, te- it's only forty years old. Yeah. yeah, whatever. They put it on the Chinese guy. Like this Peter looking guy, he looks like he's on Epstein Island. Oh, he looks like. Why does it say 40? Why on it? How old is the first Tetris? Uh, released in 1989. I don't know, it's Nick. Well, from the American, <laughs> <It's> the Chinese, <laughs> it's and, it's, and it's like thousands and thousands of years old. But it's never like, been. The used to play marbles, didn't they? Did you used to play marbles, didn't you? Remember when we was there? <laughs> you know, I was at Shed Bar. I used to collect them. Yeah, on some weird island. Didn't I? Yeah, you used to them. Yeah, he took I, didn't, I didn't do it. Well, there was no, you just fucking nicked them off me. You just grabbed these. I had to share my toys with you when you was born. Well, that's how it was. <laughs> yeah, he was 13. Yeah, he was like 13. There's a clip of him beating me. And he's like, oh, oh my god! Oh my god! There's a challenge, isn't it? So, really, they're calling it a kill screen because it's when you can't go any further mm. in a game because it's gone as far as you can go. Well, you played on the computer? Yeah. Oh, he yeah. didn't go and get the sticks and play on the table here then, like this? No, that's oh, Jenga. stick. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, I don't How do you think he beat Jenga? <laughs> oh, I was talking about Jenga. How old's Jenga? Wait, so in your head. <laughs> you thought Jenga has never been beaten? Yeah. Wait, how do you even beat Jenga? Yeah, you Jenga. must have been so confused. Yeah, how old's Jenga? <laughs> Jenga's got to be about 1,000 years old, isn't it? One point. First person to, one to two thousand years old, written Jenga. First person to ever beat Jenga is crazy. How old is? Yeah. Jenga? How old is Jenga? Te- that's Tetris. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know what you were going on about. Then. If it hits the top, then and no one's ever beaten it. No. He was the first person ever. How long's that game been out? Forty years. Forty years. Jenga came out in nineteen eighty-three. If you wanted to know that. No. Yep. Sometimes no I wonder. Like a game with wood. Wood games been out before computers. Well, I guess that's when it was. Probably won't be called Jango. It's probably packaged yeah. um, <laughs> and sold. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I remember a thing came out about it because it's uh, it was posted in this news where they're supposed to have a little bit where they have a little like a light-hearted bit and they're supposed to celebrate it. And this news anchor woman basically just shut on it, and she was like, "I've never been beaten." She was say, "But I'd say go out and get have some fresh air and touch some grass, some shit like that." Especially she was one of those people that touched grass, yeah. and then she got loads of shit for it because everyone was like, "But that is like a really good accomplishment." Like no one's ever done it. This thirteen-year-old did it, and what she, she do she wants she was pretty much, on the grass. She was pretty much just like, "Oh, stop playing fucking." She's pretty much shitting on it for being a game and hit shitting on this thirteen-year-old's accomplishment. And she was like, "Oh, what's comment game. section?" No news anchor. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> so what happened? <laughs> So they had a part on the news about this. Oh, so well done on the news. But she just basically shat on it at the end of the And wiped her ass on the grass. Uh, she insulted it. And oh. was basically like, go get some fresh air. Like, oh, she's obviously not happy. No, she was like, because that is, she's like, because beating a game isn't a life goal. Oh, she's, but she hasn't reached yeah, a life goal. Then. Free Someone else got the promotion, didn't they? Yeah. She but, didn't get the promotion, Chris. But if bless you, she, bless you but it blew it up even more. Should have sucked more, did it? Got way, it got way, way more attention because everyone was hating on her. Oh, so, don't hate on her. She's just not. It's not her fault. Probably. So the kid got more, even more like attention. I guess. Yeah, well done, kid. Well done, kid. Talking of uh, kids. Where to go, kid? We're back at Epstein Island. Yeah, here no, we go. No, on no, the no. fucking oh, roundabout. Yeah. Oh yeah, in, yeah. Stephen out, Hawking. Up and down, up and down. Do you think Stephen Hawking cock work? We might get one of the mean parts on it. You can pump him up, can't you? Oh, do you think? He goes up like that. What was that film about his life called? Um, uh, end up in a wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> Came up in a wheelchair. End up in a wheelchair. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the Wonderful Life. <laughs> was that in the film? When he flew over the... Over the thing, yeah. Island. yeah. No, he, he was on a bicycle and he was getting chased by a, a, an extraterrestrial, <laughs> E.T. Found home, found home. That's why he got, does that voice. Oh, E.T. <laughs> That's a crazy film. Yeah. Because <laughs> he, he, he got E.T. on his lap and he goes over the moon, doesn't he? Trying to get How old is E.T.? Oh, really? Yeah. Age. Probably, no, probably millions of years old. Travelled the world forever. Yeah, he's yeah, in the world. The um, kid is like space. Their fucking race. Probably. Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 Very wrinkly. Yeah. Very wrinkly. Yeah, Epstein. Well, wrinkly. What was that? Um, do you see that kid at the darts? 
The 16 year old. Well, I didn't watch him on the telly, but I did read. Yeah. Young 16 year old lad with a 21 year old girlfriend. She sucks off his little 16 year old penis all the time because she loves 16 year old Winkles. Right, so you know she's 21. 21 year old. Normally, 21 year old girls go for the older boy or man, the 25 year old, but now she wants a little winky 16 year old penis. Although well, it could be well strong, couldn't it? It could be huge. <laughs> <laughs> that, is a, that is weird though. That it is, is strange, isn't it? Yeah. Well, yeah I didn't know Especially when they are 20 year old. It's older. <laughs> Guys, yeah, normally that's the bloke's doing it. The women are saying, You dead little fucker. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what, no one's saying she's a sicker? No, that's <laughs> <laughs> why we fucking heard it here first. Yeah, yeah, she's first. a bit of a sicker doing that. I'm sure she's really nice. She sucks his 16 year old penis well. Jesus, so she hadn't, wasn't sucking it last year because he would have been 15 and underage. Did she get with him because he well, blown, she can't map up for sex drive, blowing up from it. Why would you go with a 15 year old? She can't have sex with them until they're 16. Well, how long have they been together though? No, you're allowed. Well, to, you're, you're allowed. You legally can have sex at sixteen. Yeah, but he's sixteen now. But what was he last year? Fifteen. All oh, right. And if he was with her then, what was she doing? Just flicking her bean? Was she just not? She just. I got think some of these are looking. Or is she one of these women that chase money, easy money? Because a lot of women do that. They go for a man with a nice house, a nice car. They look at their photos online. They go, oh, he looks like he's got a nice house and car. Like not all of them, but there's plenty of women that go for the man that's doing better and wealth themselves rather than the man that isn't. Yeah, the man that is is probably a, a much nicer segment. person, not Because I'm, <laughs> I'm ready. Yeah, so... Women at... This guy, oh. uh, Luke, he's like 16, who entered the World Dance Championship and oh. got, got, went all the way into the finals. I got my soul. Nah. But, um, yeah, let's see what he looks Luke. like. Oh, right, she didn't realise he was 16. <laughs> <laughs> Six, 16 stone, maybe. Is that a 16 year old? Yeah. Fuck it, he looks like he's 40! Sorry, love, sorry, so, love. Yeah, yeah, I'll punish it. No, legally, yeah. he, he is still 16. He's huge. Which is legal. Young. He, looks for like reason. he looks like Peter Kay with hair. But he was 15 when he was together. And that's, that's still legal if they were having sexual intercourse. But, it's, um, cause you, it's, you're allowed to have anal sex with another man, aren't you? An old Tory MP or a totally filthy fucking 60 year old Tory judge. He's allowed to fuck a 15 year old boy out of the arsenal because they voted that in, didn't they? <laughs> they did, they voted it, it in. It used to be a lot older, it used to be 18. And they said, no, it's wrong, got to be 15. Once <laughs> more, uh, once more the tighter anuses will want to That's so fucked up. Yeah, it's true. It's true. true story, I couldn't believe it when it happened. Yeah, it did. They voted in the 1990s or something like that, I think. It was 1990s. Why, is it, why does the, the male gay MPs and judges voted in for younger anuses to fuck? It's a fact. <laughs> you can get up. Yeah, it's a fact. I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Going back to that 16 year old dance player idea. Yeah. Does everyone that starts playing darts professionally just end up looking like an overweight, like, drunk guy from the bar? Um, no, not all of us, a lot of them, yeah. It's always been known that they just have, in the old days, yeah, they'd be playing their darts, they'd have the beer on the table, yeah. they'd smoke in the fag, wipe it down, throw their darts, come back, and that's what they was doing. Mm-hmm. So that's why they all look like the stage just, cool. Like, even that 16 year old, it was like a 40 game, year old, yeah. like, he's not even on that forced, fucking alcoholic. Yeah. But you know, apparently, I saw in the news that he was asking him yeah. how often do you train? He's like about half an hour and that's a day. He doesn't like he trains at all. It's boring. Oh, it does. Yeah, he was like, it's boring. He needs to... Um, he does not fucking train. What, did he win? Did he you said. No, he nearly he got to the final, went to yeah, the final. The final. He he never the, the, the winner still had to play a really good game to beat him. He still won about half a million quid, was it? Uh, half a million? It's a lot of chocolate bars and crisps, isn't it? And soda. Yeah, because he's Soda! Wait, can you drink alcohol at 16? You can't, can't um, I you can with your parents as a meal, and you've got, as long as you order a uh, fucking carboy. First episode, they're in between us, aren't they? Oh, yeah, because they're like the guy that had Yeah, it was free carboy. They just wanted to get like free sides, and they had to have that adult with them. They just well. wanted a pre drink. Yeah. 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 And then so the adult orders free Cardi and Cokes, and they all fuck off because it all fucked up. He ends up the carboy, all their sliders, <laughs> Cardi and Cokes, we all end up skint, and they go to another pub where he shouts his mouth off, and they all get barred. <laughs> That's making me want a car. Oh yeah, I've had a car for years. Oh, I'd love a fucking car. They really? do want the Broadway. Do they? I've only ever had the Broadway from um, Where's that? Letchworth, oh. Stevenage. Is it better than Stevenage one? Stevenage, you get quite a lot for your money to be fair. Do they do crunchy roast potatoes? Mm, they do roast potatoes. I don't remember them being really crunchy, mm. not enough to stand out. Why there is? We'll take one with us and put them in the oven. <laughs> we don't even buy anything, we just put in our fucking pockets. <laughs> fucking hell, I'm starving. Uh, well, I've got well, a 40% well. off voucher for Harvester, but you know, from it. Oh, remember those old days? Do you know, I do like the Harvester pasta. 
Yeah, but before COVID, you could just go up, but now you have to hand it to Lindy. What, even now? I think, yeah, I think even now, like, fucking old Lindsay waiting for you to come up, takes your thing, didn't they, and they put... Do you know Lindsay, then? No, I just thought, I was just thinking of a name. It's probably... Yeah, that could be a girl's name or a boy's name, can't it? There's a lot of names, isn't there? It could be boys and girls' names. Right, competition time. <laughs> Alex. <laughs> girl's name. Tony, for a and I, for a boy and a girl. Chris. Andy, and <laughs> 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 Chris, a Christina, Christopher, Chris, two Chris's, Chris for a girl, Chris for a boy, Jack, Key. Jackie, <laughs> this is the worst game. Um, Jake, Jack, 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 Jack. So what was you saying before? You said wow. something that made me think I was going to say something. You haven't really 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 got one, and so some, some girls haven't got me. Oh, Harvester, before Covid, you could just go over and get it. Oh, yeah, they probably yeah. realised how much food. Yeah, they probably realised how much <laughs> they saved say during Covid. Yeah, they had someone stand there and do it for you. Yeah, yeah. Judge, so, judge, judge you. Yeah, so what do we do? I'll tell you what, then we'll save some money and we'll cut your fucking restaurant. Yeah, we don't want to come at all. Yeah, what's going to your restaurant, but you don't want us to fucking eat. Yeah, that's our tummies up. We want to take our fucking money. Like, should we just, not, should we just post you the money in the fucking post? That's what it's like. Yeah. These fucking businesses just yeah. want to go there, hand them money, just leave with nothing. Yeah, leave with nothing. Like, I'm coming here to fucking eat. I like, yeah. let me eat. Like, yeah. isn't that one of your selling points? Like, you have yeah. this fucking. And they're trying to hide up, and you just eat into your food, innit? You haven't even tasted it, innit? How's your food? Is your food alright? How's your food alright? I'm fucking I ain't got a fucking <laughs> course. Yeah, it's still there. They do that all the time. Right? That's like. There's like a running gag for now. Come you're back in 40 it. minutes, love. Come back in 40 minutes and ask me, you know, alright? It's always so annoying, isn't it? Every it's time they ask me and Jason, we're always like, yeah, thanks, and they leave, and we're like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> like they just ruin the meal. Yeah. Every time. Maybe, like, they'll so come up. Be politely just say, look, like, I'll let you know later. No, we don't do that to them. <laughs> I'll let you know. We don't do that to them. We do it when they're gone, just as a joke. You know because we think that the contrast is so funny, them come up to you and you're really polite, and then you're like, <laughs> I'll let you know in the morning when like, I have shit. You could, you could be eating it being we'll like, give this, me the is, test. this tastes like shit, fucking hate this. Like, how is it? You're like, oh, it's beautiful, thank you. It's amazing, thank what you, a lovely place. Here's my money, oh. here's my car keys. Yeah, yeah. Now can I go and get me for carving now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they didn't have that pasta bit. It would just be like a normal pub restaurant. Yeah, it'd be, it'd be shitty food. Yeah, I wouldn't even bother going there. Like, she's the only reason I go there is for the pasta. Yeah. Why don't you get yourself a pass, packet of pasta for 75p from the shop? Save well, yourself 10 pounds. It's pretty much all you could eat, because, but you're not paying for it all you can eat. Yeah, and the main, the main reason was I like their blue cheese sauce, but when yeah, I bought no, a blue cheese sauce, sauce from a um, uh, supermarket... Tried a different supermarket. Yeah, was tried a different one. Didn't taste anything like it. And then I never ch- got another one after that. But I should, though, because I did the same thing with tartar sauce when I first came across tartar sauce. Ta-ta. I bought a tartar Ta-ta. sauce from Asda, and that tartar sauce wasn't like the tartar sauce that I liked it that wanted me to buy the tartar sauce. So you have to find out who their supplier is, don't you? But find I did find... Like, supplier is. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure that... Supplying the shit. That, 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 that first tartar sauce I bought was actually a, old... a special one as well. And that, that was... I didn't like it at all, it didn't taste anything like it. Then I bought the cheaper one and I was like, yeah, this is it, this is it, this tastes good. It's a nice one, it tastes totally different. I was at the show, yeah, talking about tasty food, and he was doing these mega burgers, like 20 oh, quid each, sorry. right? And everyone was queuing for miles for oh. these mega burgers oh. at, 20, at 20 quid, right? Oh, what the fuck? And he just shut in my direction. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. come he out. Right? He gave me a voucher, that's it, because I'm a stall holder, he gave me a voucher, right? yeah. And, um, and they've done all these burgers with all this special sauce. Now. And I told him <gasps> how I used to, um, and I said, but my local place, Jicky George, and he was like, oh, they're, they're fucking bollocks. Well, I used to deliver their sauces. I know exactly when you know, got the sauces from mm. that. He said, really? Can we, uh, uh, tell me where you, they get them. So I said, he goes, so can I have anything you want? He said, and he fed me for three days. Anything I wanted. I'm like your baby free. boy. So I, gave, I told him the company that supplied their sauce. Really? Yeah. What did you get to eat? Whatever I wanted. He fed him like his little baby boy. The fucking mega 20 pound meal things. Oh my god, I'm getting so I couldn't, and there's so much stuff, he could put some cheese and chips and that, he just gave me Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> we got it, and it's like, oh, I've been drinking for it, and no wonder I'm, put, and I'm still putting weight on. <laughs> <laughs> now, this was last summer. Oh, last summer. <laughs> just 10 decades what ago. What the hell? I didn't know about this. Well, well just come to me, or have my face. Just come to me, <laughs> yeah. When you start talking about it, and I thought, oh, well, I'm fucking just starving, bro. God, so he was just feeding you. Like It was top of the range gear, mate. Top of the range. Top of the range. Just for telling him the. Just so he like. Well, that's inside information. Is it? Remember, I had that sauce in a big blue container from the same company. Do you remember? Yeah. And I put in some Jack Daniels and all that shit. And oh. It was the bollocks, wasn't it? That was the big Yeah, but obviously bomb. the supplier's is online somewhere. And because. He didn't know enough. He's. Hi! Have you seen yeah. all that uh, shit about them Stanley cups? You can get burgled, wouldn't we? All that. Really expensive water. 
Yeah, cut that out. Well, that um, cups. Like, mm-hmm. uh, what's that? Stand- they're, they're just that. They're like it's just a normal thing, but they're like really expensive. Like a standard one is just like that doesn't look like it's going to stand up. The real well. ones that are like around fifty, and there's like they it said that they put out like rare colours and shit, and they had it. They had a collab with. Um, Oh, that's this what five that coffee company. <laughs> well, it's travelled around the world, that is, and it still works. If you put hot coffee in it, it'll keep hot for 12 hours. It cost me a couple of quid, I've had it all around the world. All around. They had a collab with Starbucks. So it just says, like, both of them on the cup, and it's like, people send them for like 284 quid. Oh, oh, oh. oh for a drinking bench. It's just, like, really popular. I think, well, it, I know it got even more popular because it's a TikTok, <laughs> but apparently people were saying there was a thing where there was, like, a car caught on fire and shit and then that survived and apparently that helped it go like more viral well but what's the charge of your car like, catching love I feel, I feel like it's on. more like TikTok and that made it even popular but that's mad isn't it like, more like TikTok like, how you like, like people just buy them and resell them TikTok for like hundreds and it's just a it's just a bottle it's a drinking water. vessel yeah yeah probably more that's mad isn't it yeah but if you could get your hands on one of those Starbucks ones you could sell that for hundreds Oh, let's go get it out, get it out. <laughs> There's a video of someone jumping oh, over on like a Starbucks counter and just grabbing all of them in front of everyone and just running. Really? So they could sell them all, yeah. Are they over here then? Oh, yeah. I think our ones look different. Like, that one was all pink, and I think the one in America is like red that I saw the other day. Oh, we need to go in every Starbucks. But yeah. Remember I'm... that really nice. We went past Starbucks. Remember that really nice. In Angel, we went to. Who's that? We went to Angel. Oh, how is she? London. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, there's a, oh yeah, yeah, on the outside. Was, she was a good girl. Yeah. <laughs> he's gonna have to go right. He doesn't want it talked about. He's talking about it. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, because I've, sex. I've seen loads of people. Like, well, I've seen people with these cups and didn't know anything until I saw it online. Like fucking people talking about mm. this. But I don't know, I think people might be buying the one that looks like it and not the actually Stanley one. Oh, right. So now the, like, the non-branded version I think mm. might be popular, but that branded one is like expensive. What's the brand called? Stanley. It's called it's Stanley Cup. Stanley Cup. Which is, isn't that like a cup in the ashes? For the fucking... It's a sports cup, cricket. Isn't it? Is it? Is it cricket or is it an American thing that's for? I've got a clue. I know they used to make knives, no. didn't they? Stanley Knife. Yeah, they went with David Bowie. Oh, yeah, they had a card, didn't they? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Oh, good times. Yeah, like that, didn't you? I Did like you that. do anything with your throat? Yes, I masturbated. <laughs> <laughs> How was it? Oh, fucking lovely. It's like the first time ever. <laughs> every time. Like, Why is every time? <laughs> it's like. Oh, every time's like the first. It's like time. Groundhog Day. You know, first, it's like the first time you've ever come. It's like, oh, fucking hell, man, that's amazing. You're just yeah. shaking it, don't you? <laughs> you get it's good to clean yourself up. <laughs> And then one, eight hours later, you've forgotten about it, and you start. You went, oh my god, look, it's gone. It's gone off. It's gone off. It's, oh, do that. Oh, fucking off. Like, oh, fuck's sake. And it's just like that. Did you count down to 12? No, I just came straight away. Happy New Year. 2024. Oh, 2024, 2020, more bitches, more money. Um, so, what was I doing? Um, I was at home. I think I had a couple of. Um, I've got glasses of Baileys. Nice, you've got nice. a Baileys. Yeah, yeah, I might have had um, yeah. uh, Spice Rum Amaretto with Diet Coke. Tell them. Mm. They're all full of shit chemicals, Diet Coke. Fuck off. You never had <laughs> um, Sorry. And um, yeah, eventually it went off. I was just sitting in the front room on my own crying. <laughs> oh, no, I, wasn't, I was joking, I wasn't crying. I was going to say, we never did our fucking. Um, I, was just, I was actually chatting with my sister. Boxing Day thing, but we went to Finney, didn't we, instead? What? We normally come around here for Boxing Day if we're not here on Christmas. You were bound to be Christmas Day and Boxing Day. No, I didn't. Well, what I thought we went to the thing? Didn't I come thing? around Boxing Day? I was like, I can't remember nothing. <laughs> I wasn't well, was no, I? No, we went to fucking thingies. Dan's. See? You didn't come we in. We always ordered Dan's. We well, did one day. But I'm saying, we, that's how we think. What? Yeah, yeah, you came around on Christmas Eve. Ah, before. You was first. You know what I mean? But I patronised me. <laughs> 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 uh, um, should we come around for the Chinese New Year? <laughs> <laughs> and we all eat several in chips. Charlie, do you that's April the 17th, isn't it? I can't remember. We have to go to Chinatown. I know we did a podcast episode that had when I brought those um, things. Oh, yeah. And that great clip of Chris. Oh, yeah. That's amazing. Oh, that, that was great. I wonder if we're ending it. I don't know if we have any more of those. Wonder if it. Um, so, Chris, New Year's, yeah, uh, New Year's was fine, yes. 
And it was fine in there. Yeah, I just um, chilled out, man. I was having a drink. It was nice, actually, because I've worked so hard right up to Christmas, didn't I? Yeah. So it's about time where we've no, laid I'd down. I had an operation, drink, didn't I? Sit down. Five hours surgery. And then I was out working in minus four degrees for like seven days oh, on the trot. Then I came over a, a day. Then I was back out at 10 day shopping everything on the Monday. And I was back out again another seven days on the trot. Back and out. I hadn't even recovered properly. Probably like, but now. And um, so, yeah, yeah I was quite happy to. Um, I just had a quiet um, New Year's, really. I just I needed it. Jesus. It's just what you needed. That sounds good. Exactly why I didn't fucking contact you. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was struggling when, you know, when we went to um, Dan's and all that. And, oh, yeah. yeah. I was quite quiet there, weren't I? I was just so tired. Yeah. And you couldn't hear anything. I couldn't hear nothing, yeah. Uh, it's hard for me to do that, isn't it? Because I had to go to work. It's hard for me to do that. Yeah, I had to drive across like, yeah, yeah. That's why I could hear when you were talking. Which I can't remember why. Oh, is it just we wanted to be in the same car? No, yours is the only clean one. Yeah, where did you go oh. New Year's Eve then? Uh, London. Really? We went to the... Was that New Year's Eve? No, it was New Year's Eve, yeah. The 411, so yeah. let me give you the 411. Oh, yeah, so keep rolling, keep it's rolling. Too expensive. Yeah, it is too expensive, because I thought... We wouldn't go there normally, unless, if it's just me and Chris. Well, I thought, oh, was Liam, Liam we disappeared his missus, right. right? So I thought, oh, they've gone to London. Because they normally sometimes go to London. I was thinking, shit, man, it's pissing down, man, it's cold, it's going to cost them a lot of money. It'd be better off, you know, doing something local. But I, but I don't know where they went. They didn't tell me. I did ask them. I, I'm not sure they went on their family in Luton or what. We was local last year, and we was in line. Much cheaper. We was in, we was in, but we was in Old Town in line. It was raining, and the New Year hit. Yeah. <laughs> the, fireworks, the fireworks went off, like, in the background, and we was in the pouring rain in line. Yeah, we, <laughs> we was we, looking in, and everyone was cheering. Is that lines? We was in a in line. In the line to get in, in the queue to get in. When it when it uh, hit. And you know, everyone inside like, was celebrating. And everyone's like cheering. We're looking in the window, everyone's like cheering, kissing. And we're all pissing down. <laughs> <laughs> it was like a fucking other side of fucking what was the Oh, like, no. Like, yeah. and everyone was just looking inside. Yeah. <laughs> so depressing outside. Yeah. It's a funny oh, story. We were in High Street. Yeah. yeah. And what about this year? Issue. We, we went in the bar, new bar, four on one. Yeah, it's really new bar four on one. Where is it? It's a, we was in a new angel. bar, come on. That was called the four one one. That made me fucking. <laughs> You're in the bar. Yeah. That's called four one one. That's the name of the bar. <laughs> yeah, four one one is a bar. Yeah. In the day, you know, you can eat in there. Okay, where's this thing? Camden Lock. Angel. Oh, so are you. He doesn't even disgust for a dead stop. He's on his last day in the day. Give him a compliment. Yeah. He hates me <laughs> so much. He <laughs> so yeah. says thank you with Venom. We've had a nice time. Yeah. <laughs> fucking twin. Cold, was it? It was cold, yeah, but yeah. we uh, got a table. It was uh, early. and um, Went to a bar. It was actually really big and it was really, it was nice in there. You got a nice big table. Was nice, yeah. Yeah, me add something to Pay eat. some pool for free. Free pool table you I could play all night. That's a bargain, wasn't it? So how much does train tickets cost? Uh, uh, 15 quid, 15, I think. Oh, yeah. That's cheap. Taxi? Actually, no, that's just the underground. <laughs> so I think proper. mine was 15 altogether. Or 15 yeah, it to 20. Was, it no. sounds about right. It's out of yeah, for you, it was. Off peak. Me, it was probably like 20, 25. What? It was cheaper for me because I just fucking... Skip through that shit, feel me? I yeah. just pay my phone. I don't want to it was actually nice, yeah. Oh, so you was at the Angel. But before that, it's the Sissington, isn't it? Yeah. That's where I get off for work. I really you get off for work. Nice, I know the pub. What the red one? Opposite four one one. Four one one. Right by the, the Starbucks. Really yeah. nice building. We went in there for a second. I walked there to work. What's the pub called? Is it like uh, the Red Lion? Lion? I think it's been there for like hundreds of years. Or something. Is that the one you've gone into? I think it was a Red Lion. Um, yeah. We've all been in the same yeah. car. You have to cross the road. You come out of the Angel yeah. and it's across the road over there. Uh, not it? that pub. The and there's the other one. No, come, come, out, the, <laughs> come out of the Angel and Sorry. down that way. We went left. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> it depends it depends which way you come out. Well, yeah. when I went in their toilet, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's got like a window. It's cracked open. Like, it's yeah. all wired up. And it's got toilet tissue on a like, cardboard roll. <laughs> and it's got a yeah, toilet handle. There's a, little, yeah, there's a little handle as well like, attached to the toilet. Yeah, it flushes. Let's see. It's quite careful. It's a whole thing. You can tell it's an old pub though. Yeah, I was red light. Yeah, yeah. Well, the price I actually quite enjoyed it in there. I, yeah, I, I love oh, it. Really? Yeah. Like, have you been in oh, the daytime? Chris has so, Chris's phone's excitement in the weirdest places. You should go in the daytime <laughs> as well. They've got nice little like dingy fucking empty pub. Oh, that's the whole like, story. So you know what I mean? Every time I'm there, I think, oh, I'd have to come down here for a drink. I did it a couple of times, but one I was with the NAR a few years ago. Yeah, it was shit. Another time I was with a colleague, but I was tired, so I'm with Frank. 
Yeah. Who's Frank? I was a pedo. But yeah, it's like, usually, you know, we wouldn't really want to go to somewhere so expensive unless other people wanted to. Um, There's so many nice pubs though in London, you wouldn't be able to visit them all. It's nice going to a new place, yeah. isn't it? And like, seeing something new. Yeah, I'll you take myself there okay, next week on my own. Anything new is... Oh, yeah. Oh, well, you know. We'll come. <laughs>